Hey guys, this is me and your Zombie Turtle, and uh, today I found this at Target. Lunchables Natural Uncured Pepperoni and Cheese. New. So, yeah, I bought this because uh, my previous Lunchables pizza it was very different from what I've had. The pizza part, the bread, they changed it to be flaky and weird and like rough. Instead of soft and flaky. Mm. Yeah, let's go see what it's got. But, yeah, by the way, this is just basically, um, uh, pepperoni without nitrates and stuff. So, yeah, let's open this up. By the way, just looking at this value, the statistics. And yeah, look at that. No nitrates except for celery. Wait, you can actually microwave this? What? To heat, build pizzas on microwave, old plate, microwave on high. Okay, I might actually do that. Hold up guys, I'll just open this up. And yeah, I'm happy to say they've gone back to the old, um, pizza bread stuffs yeah and I had a little bit of this cheese it tastes a bit more sharp like skim milk cheese but yeah less salty and the pepperoni I'm gonna try a, a little bite I can already smell it it's different Yeah, definitely a lot more lean. Spices taste less, um, heavy. Yeah. So yeah, let's make a pizza and put it in the microwave. Yikes. So, yeah, guys, check it out. My first microwavable Lunchables pizza. Pretty disappointed, but uh, a good learning experience. I gotta put the ingredients more towards the middle. So, I'll go. I've let it cool down for a bit. Now I'm gonna taste it. So, yeah. Let's -a go. So yeah, I've got myself a little pizza slice, and I'm just gonna put this in my mouth. And yeah, as I put that in my mouth, I just felt sadness. And this is very... It's a disappointment. I'm not even gonna try to make a better pizza. Yeah, the flavor is really lacking. It's terrible in comparison to a normal Lunchables pizza. Yeah, so I won't even try to make another pretty pizza like all this around. I don't care about that. This is kind of sad. So, yeah, I'm gonna, it really made my ma my, my water, <laughs> my, it really made my mouth w watery, but that's just an automatic response. So, yeah, be right back. My cat wants some pizza too, but he's not gonna get any. It's bad for his health, or his stomach. So, yeah guys, this is what I would call a perfect pizza. At least now, because back in my day, in like 2010, the pepperoni pizzas were switched. The pepperoni was over there, and the cheese was over there, and life made so much more sense. But, yeah, let's check it out. And yeah, 
It's basically normal Lunchables. Oh my gosh. I've got to clear the saliva from my mouth. This is the first meal of my day. It's so good. The pepperoni is sweet and salty and fat, fattening, fat, fattish, good spices. The marinara sauce is sweet. It's pretty epic. And yeah, the cheese. The cheese wasn't very noticeable because in normal normal lunchables it's it's very noticeable it's some good mozzarella but actually this was uh, lower than the refrigerator temperature since it was in my car overnight and then I just put it in the refrigerator so yeah pretty good not as good as the original but not too bad not very not lacking like if you're not a person like me you wouldn't really notice <laughs> so I'm gonna finish this up and tell you guys what I think and yeah I said I wasn't gonna feed my cat but uh it's just a little piece I won't hurt him and yeah this pizza is pretty awesome that was kind of sad, but I guess if you're normal, it's it's um, palatable, and yeah, pretty good pizza. Later, guys.